guys, so today I have a haul for you all. I love saying that. Whenever I do hauls, I always say haul for you all, and it just it works out really well. Anyways, I'm feeling rather colorful today and just excited about this video. Ugh, ugh. And I went shopping this weekend. Uh, probably shouldn't have, but I did. And today I went to Goodwill and I went thrifting and got a bunch of stuff, a large, large bag of things but it was only $28 altogether, so it's okay. And then yesterday I went to the mall and just picked up like a few things. So I'm gonna show you all my like clothing thrift stuff first and then the rest of my stuff from yesterday. So let's get started. So as I said, I went to Goodwill and this is my large bag of things. And I'm just gonna show you what's inside. So I don't know how many of you watch Miranda Sings, but she always talks about her uncle. And so me and my friends who all watch Miranda Sings will always relate things and be like, well, my uncle's gonna tell on you, so. Or something and just say something with uncle. And then I was looking through just like large men's shirts. And I like wearing just like big t-shirts around the house. As I said, I rarely wear pants, especially when I'm in the house. Just kidding. Only when I'm in the house, I don't wear pants. <laughs> Not outside of the house, that only happened one time, okay? Anyways, I got this shirt, and it says, I got this shirt from my favorite great uncle. And I think it's so funny. And then, this is the best part. On the sleeve, it says, Big John. <laughs> I'm sure that the person actually got this from their favorite great uncle. And it's just like a really funny shirt. I don't know why I thought it was so funny, but it's big, and so I just found it humorous that I can like wear this with high-waisted shorts or something, or just jeans or leggings, I don't know, but I got this t-shirt. <laughs> the next shirt I got I'm really excited about, but I don't know why I'm so excited about it, but it looks like this, and I think I just really like the colors. It's this pastel, like, mint-ish color, and then it has, like, pastel pinks and purples and oranges and yellows and just, I don't know why I liked it so much, but it's high collared, and I'm gonna button it up all the way and, like, wear this with circle skirts and stuff, and so I just found this so freaking adorable, and I love pastel colors, and I know summer is kind of ending and fall is approaching, and I should be transitioning to more, like, darkish fall colors, but I just wanted one last shebang with my pastels, and so I got this. This is, like, a women's golf shirt. Like, I'm pretty sure that's what it is, and it has like I said, like flowers and tropical things and dragonflies and just, uh, I love it. There's butterflies on it and it just, it makes me happy looking at it. And so I picked this up and I think this was like four doll hairs, dollars. Okay, and now actually getting more into fall, I love wearing these huge grandpa sweaters in the fall with leggings and boots and it's just so comfortable, or even in the winter. And so I wanted to get some before they started like running out of my thrift stores. And so I got one, and it's this giant sweater, and you guys probably think it's so ugly, but it is so comfortable. I haven't washed this yet, I don't know why this is on my head. It's just this old grandpa thing, and when I put it on, I was like, my granddad would definitely wear something like this. And I thought that the neckline was going to be kind of weird on, but it looked perfectly fine. And it's the same thing around the cuffs at the wrists and at the bottom down here. And it's just like a funky pattern and it's really, really warm. And so I'm going to wear this in the fall time and just be so comfy cozy in it. I was going to show all of my t-shirts at the beginning, but I guess I forgot one. Because I, I was like, I didn't only get one t-shirt, I got two. And so the next t-shirt that I got, I was really shocked finding. I don't know why I was so shocked about it, but I'm in Young Life at my school and I found this Young Life shirt and it's comfort colors and I love comfort colors. Like they're kind of like the more faded designs and it's just like a big, it's so big. It's like this big uh, slouchy t-shirt and I just wanted to wear this like to our like club things during the week. Club is like for Young Life. So if you're in Young Life, give this video a big thumbs up because it rocks. But the back of this, this is like a really old shirt. I've never seen this shirt before at any of the Young Life camps or like anywhere being sold. And it says, I'm so VIP right now. And I don't really get what that means. I'm sure it was like an inside joke or something. But I just bought this to wear like to bed. I don't know. Just really anywhere, you know? <laughs> Next, I got two pairs of pantalones. And this first one, okay, I really am into uh, those long, flowy pants that are so comfortable. And you guys know that I got a pair in Breckenridge. I got those like tie-dye pants. Some of you like them, some of you don't. I don't really care if you don't. I have like these pattern pants from 
another thrift store that are like floral patterned and they literally feel like pajama pants when you wear them but at school I always get so many compliments on them and it's just really really nice so I found these ones these are actually pajama pants but when I tried them on I was kind of like debating if I could wear them or not as pants but they're these purple pants and they're not see-through so don't think that they are but they're like this just kind of patterned thing and it's just like violet colored and dark blue colored um, and they're really long and they are the most comfortable you know just that mm, oh my god when I'm touching them it's just like that soft material and you're just like wow I know exactly what you're talking about like the softest pants ever yeah that's what these are if I can wear these with something to school I'll find some outfit like that but either way I could wear these like around my house to bed or just when I want some comfy pants to wear they literally feel like heaven I'd put them on my face but I don't know where these things have been so um, I'm gonna wash them and everything like that I'm gonna wash all of this stuff okay I just got this today so it's all dirty right now but yeah I got these and I love them these were like $4.95 I want to say and so I was like you know what it's worth it and next also with the whole pattern pants deal these actually are pants they're not pajama pants but they look like this and they're navy blue and they go all the way down like any pant would and then they have these gold details all over them and I really don't know what these signs are I was trying to figure it out um, but I really just can't decide it's like two turtles right here um, a little like birdie thing upside down here I think that's a sailboat uh, another turtle another sailboat and then like a lizard and a fish and it's really weird designs but I think I can rock these I tried them on and they looked really good and I love like flowy pants like this and it's like a silky material and once again these were like five bucks and so I figured why not and I can wear these to school and just be banging in my new pants and next I got a pair of shoes and I did get another pair of shoes in my last thrift haul and some of you were like ew oh my god that is so gross like you're wearing thrifted shoes what the heck but you know what I really don't care these look like they have maybe been worn twice Lula shut it shut your mouth they're from Talbot's but they're like these brown loafers <laughs> and they kind of look like men's shoes but I promise these are women's shoes they fit me perfectly like they're actually the perfect size and they're just like this dark brown color and they have these little tassels at the front I really don't know what attracted me so much to these shoes but I just feel like they're nice for fall and I can wear them with like skinny jeans and like a nice blouse and I feel like I'd be able to style them nicely and these were I want to say three dollars and so I grabbed them and I ran and I love these they kind of look like grandma shoes but I don't know I like them and I don't have like a nice pair of loafers and even if these are from Talbot's I don't know how nice of a store that is but um, either way I really like them and that's everything that I got at Goodwill okay and I was just planning on making this a thrift haul but then I realized that I went shopping yesterday too and I wanted to show you guys the things that I got even though it wasn't that much but I went to PacSun and I picked up this skirt because my friend Michelle she was wearing this in so many photos and I would just like admire it in her photos and be like oh my god where did she get that I need that skirt I need it and I finally got it and so like I said this is from PacSun and it's a sunflower maxi skirt and it's absolutely perfect it has two slits on each side in the front so you don't have any like tripping problems when you're walking it's like a black mini skirt underneath and then when it gets lower it's like see-through this is just oh my god it's so cute this was priced at $32 and I was kind of upset about that but I mean it's PacSun so obviously it's gonna be a bit more expensive it wasn't on sale or anything but I mean I just really had to get it because it's my baby and this is so me I mean how is this not and so I got this and it's something that I've wanted for a really long time so I picked it up and I do have a low-key obsession with sunflowers so that skirt was absolutely perfect thumbs up this video if you also have an obsession with sunflowers I don't know what it's about them but I love them the next place I went to was Bath and Body Works and I'm sure this happens to all of you as well but those people who work there are so good at selling things and I just don't understand how I can go in for one thing and end up leaving with 15 things I went in for one thing and one thing only and that was my mindset when I went in because Bath and Body Works is so addictive for me I have like too many body sprays and just ugh 
But anyways, I went in for one thing and it was a car freshener, like those little clip-in things that uh, Bath & Body Works sells that you can put your little scents in and they're called like scent portables and you can put them in your car. And so I went in and I did get one of those. When I walked in, the lady was like, hey, did anybody tell you about our deal that we're having today? And I was like, no, no one did. And so she held up one of these things and she was like, we're giving away these for free at the register and as long as they're metal you can get them and so I got this one and it has a little owl on it but I was like hey what the heck is this I'm not just gonna get this random metal thing what is this for and she was like oh there are new decorative air fresheners and so this is just the holder for one of them so of course their little scheme was to have you get this for free and then you buy the actual thing because you're not just gonna get the holder and not have the air freshener so of course I fell for it but I got this <laughs> and so this is what goes inside of it and this is the scent pineapple mango and so they come in these little boxes and they're like the refills they look like this like they do on here they're like this little fan thing and they come detached from here you have to screw this little fan thing into the scent and then the scent goes up the paper and then throughout your room whatever room you put it in and so then you place this in the little holder and then it just looks like this and it's all decorative and cute and when you touch it, there's like the scent on your hands. And this actually does work and go throughout your whole entire room. Like I said, I got the pineapple mango scent, which is like this little orange box thing. There's different scents that they have, but this smells so good and my room smells so good right now. It normally smells like dirty laundry, so this is a change. And like I said, I got the one with the owl on it just because I thought it was so freaking cute. And so I now have this in my room. I wasn't planning on getting it, but I did. And then, like I said, I went in for a car freshener, but of course they were having deals on those too. And so with the whole car freshener thing, they were having a buy three, get one free sale. And so, but that was with the holders and then the little things that you put inside of the holders. And so I bought a holder and then I bought something to go inside of it. And so that was two. And then the lady at the cash register was like, you know, if you just buy another one of those refill things, you can get one for free. And I was like, Oh, and they're only three dollars these little things and so the scent I was originally gonna get was pumpkin apple and I did get it and so that's what's in here now and the holder that I got is like this little cute owl and he's gold with like a brown a dark brown background and my car is tan and so I don't know I thought it worked out well and I thought he was so freaking cute and so like I said I have the pumpkin apple scent in here right now but that was two of them and so then she was like hey go back and pick up two more and you'll just have a deal on your hands. And so I got the fresh linen scent and you, what you do is like you peel these open and then you like replace them into the little holder. And then I got mahogany teak wood and so my car is gonna smell like Abercrombie. And so I went and I picked this one up. That's my like free thing. And then this one as well. That's actually everything that I got at Bath and Body Works and everything that I got all together. Like I said, I was gonna originally make it a thrift haul, but then I figured why not show you what I got yesterday as well? Because I'm obsessed with that skirt and then like my scents, new smells. My car smells so good, by the way. Pumpkin apple is like, mmm. I wanted to get a fall scent so it would start getting me in the mood, and it definitely is. Mm, it just smells so good. It just reminds me of Halloween and just Thanksgiving and really fun times. <laughs> That was really weird. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this haul and enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye. Uh, uh. <sighs> uh, and so, I don't know, but they're from... Stop! They kind of look like grandpa shoes. <clears throat> they kind of look like grandma shoes. Bath and Body Works. And so, when I... Ar <sighs> when I walked in, the lady was like, Hey, so, and so she was like, there are new. I got a fake ID and a checklist. It goes never meet a girl on Craigslist. And never spend your money on a necklace. Three square meals, homie, gotta have breakfast. Real shit, she be paying for the date.